Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you start yeah. to start to pick out the little bits that actually all totally. match up, and you see the patterns, and you can yeah. see how it all sort of strings together slightly. So. Totally, and then you just realize that the universe is always speaking to you, and yeah. when you when you when you literally feel that sense of knowing that oh my god, like we are all connected. The universe is speaking to me. That's a game changer. Yeah, Thank you. well, that's it. There's also the the other side of it where it's like you have to be a bit careful not to go too far into it. <laughs> Send yourself over the edge if you see what I mean. Yeah, so, yeah. There's a there's a balance point. So uh, yeah. yeah, I think I went over the edge though. Yeah, it's a day. I'm hanging in the sunshine. You should hit me with the splash gun. So I cool down. Won't you come on over? There we go. Hey, what's up? There we go. How are you, man? I, I'm I'm good. How are you? Good. Where where are you at? England? Where where what's yeah, that? Brighton. Oh, okay. Nice. Yeah, yeah. On the on the south coast here. Yeah. It's actually quite a nice day today. <laughs> ah, nice. How did you find out about me? Were you referred or was it YouTube or Yeah, well it was it was a YouTube thing, really. So um um no so so basically i was i'm 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 a recovering heroin addict i went through an issue um a while back and had a bit of a um an experience it was a meditation experience and something appeared to me and had this had this thing happen um and then i went on a bit of a quest to find out what was going on with that um <laughs> and i found you along the way and okay. you were talking about um energy healing and that sort of thing um, cause one of the things that, uh, basically I, 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 I was, I was, um, I had a meditation experience and I, something appeared in front of me. It was like a blue sun and, um, I could feel the, the warmth and the heat and anyway, I, so I was like, I wasn't really sure what was going on. So I opened my eyes and saw like nothing was there and it was like just back in the room normal. I closed my eyes. It's all, all still there. So I was like, what am I supposed to do with this? So I was like, um, <laughs> Uh, I, I sort of like just thought sort of, who are you what what is this this sort of thing and I, I got back I'm, I'm source and then I, and I was like well I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do with that either so I was, I was, <laughs> yeah, I was, uh, um, I was like well what, what am I supposed to be doing with myself and he said oh, I got healer is what I got um, and so that's that, yeah and then and other, other things bit, different, different bits happen but yeah then then it sort of disappeared after that, but then I've had other experiences from that. But yeah, so basically I'm on this sort of healer path and okay. um, I feel that I am. I, um, uh, yeah. And then, and then, so I, I did my, went off on a YouTube quest <laughs> on, on the internet, <laughs> looking for information and various different things and um, came across stuff about, sort of, you know, consciousness actually affecting reality and actually consciousness being the, overarching thing rather than emanating from um reality if you see what i mean uh yeah so, absolutely there's a big difference yeah 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 exactly so uh so yeah so then and and yeah i, I came across your work and you were talking about something with eric pearl i think that you were yes. Yes. yeah talking about um and and yeah that resonated with me quite a lot of the time and uh yeah i just i've so i mean i, I told you a bit about my story i've, I've struggled a bit with um substances and addiction so basically i'm still struggling with addiction stuff i've, I've you know i'm not a heroin addict anymore obviously i say obviously but that's how i just reach out i was in a position where i could do it so um and i I, I fully subscribe to this remote thing as well so um yeah so as far as i'm concerned if if there's a if there's the field of consciousness it's sort of to do with intent almost it's sort of like yeah if, absolutely yeah so like, obviously if you're yeah, we're having this conversation. This is a we're, this is a connection. There is a connection for yeah. us. So therefore, yeah. Yeah. any healing yeah. that happens or, or whatever or anything we want to do is, is the same. So it's the um, I think yeah, everything is for frequency. Everything is is a frequency. Yeah, it's absolutely. a range of frequencies, light, sound, whatever. Do you know what I mean? And um, yeah, I think there's a lot in the in the sort of like the the like sound healing as well that sort of thing you know absolutely and, and it, there's just a different way of doing it so i actually got um a little frequency generator thing i was going to put in with the mushrooms so i put like a you know the 528 hertz and all that yeah stuff. 
put that going out there. So I'm going to probably start doing that. So anyway, so uh, you're, you're talking about putting it in the room. Yeah. Just, yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. Just playing, playing the frequency. Yeah. Absolutely. There, there is, that will only help. Yeah. Well, you can't, yeah. You can't, the, can't yeah. Cause the problem. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to put the fight. There's no way su subjecting the mushrooms to the 528, the 528 frequency could possibly do anything but help. No, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, okay. yeah, totally. So in your YouTube quest, uh, what kind of information resonated the most with you? Well, I am so um, I mean, to, to start with, it was, um, I, I'm quite scientific. So I went, so mm -hmm. I, I went down the, so I, I was, so I was into aliens. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so I, I came across, was it Stephen Greer or something? Yep. And, um, yep. and he was um, talking about, um, doing like, uh, going out, getting UFO sightings. Yes. Five. Doing. Is that what it's called? I believe I that's what he labels his gatherings of. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I, I, yeah. I've just been looked at it on YouTube if you see what I mean. Mm -hmm. So um but it's talking about that and yeah obviously they're sat there meditating projecting where they are and then getting getting sightings apparently so yeah um, that sort of started me off and then then i was then i went down the quantum physics route so there was that whole yeah. double split experiment thing and like yeah. that, that actually so then it's just like what is going on it there's just <laughs> yeah. more that i need to know That's awesome man. and it just opens everything up just a massive can of worms um then I, I I had a bit of an experience that I had a sort of a telepathic experience, I'd say, that um, was telling me about sort of psychedelics and stuff like that, and, and how that they are they they should be used in like a, a almost like a ritualistic way. Yep. Um, but they're useful for opening like portals to that sort of that sort of realm of experience. Absolutely. Um, and and then that also led me down. So I started looking at mushrooms and things like that. So then then that led me down the the healing part of it because there's a lot of um other things uh, you know um you know immunity and stuff like that actual physical stuff rather than the the, the spiritual stuff yeah 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 uh, that, that I help with as well so i then i've i've gone down the road and started a business so i do this is a sussex shroomery so i grow uh oh, great like lion's mane and oyster mushroom um is mushrooms legal there no, no, magic uh, mushrooms okay. aren't. So the, the the ones that I grow are, are, are gourmet medicinal ones. Mm -hmm. uh, so oyster, which is specifically good for um, good for immune system and things like um, bone yep. uh, bone growth. And lion's mane is um, a um, like a, to do with your mental focus. So it um, has something in it called has something that emulates something called human nerve. Uh, nerve growth factor or something so it uh um actually stimulates neuron growth and neuron regeneration in your brain to help and that's, and that's supposed to like in theory help with dementia and stuff like that and you know any sort of degenerative brain brain diseases type thing so um so yeah so that, that's that's what i'm doing at the moment you are on a great path dude well I'm trying, but I'm I'm still struggling. You're doing, stuff yeah. Too. I mean, yeah, yeah. Sounds like you're yeah, doing. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. So when you watched any of my videos and and a couple of them, I I kind of show people how to feel these frequencies. Can you have you ever been well, able to feel them? I've I have tried. Um, I do. There, there's been occasions, um, and, but it's not a it's not a. Con constant thing do it. i mean i can't it's also almost like i like feeling that ball of energy mm -hmm. uh like sometimes like like so at the moment i just probably i don't no I'm not sure comes and goes yeah it kind of sort of comes and goes yeah, yeah okay well hopefully so, after this session it'll just come it won't yeah. <laughs> it won't go yeah yeah yeah, oh, I, yeah well, let's hope so <laughs> uh have you uh ever done any kind of energy work or anything um uh, no no the only thing i did i did a, I, I went on a um i went on a course that was uh, uh do you know do you, do you know tom campbell at all because you know tom yeah campbell? yeah my big yeah. toe yeah yeah yeah. yeah yeah so i went on one of his um um retreats a while back it was a few years back didn't quite have the experience that i was looking for but it, i you know it was, I, there was 
there was energy healing involved in that and there were people doing healing on each other and people, yeah okay you know, the sort of thing so okay. so yeah so that's that's the only real exposure i've had to that so okay nice it was a good so, experience yeah i i i'm a i'm a big fan of his uh he's got a very scientific approach yeah to yeah. explaining yeah i i actually got into this through science myself okay yeah like I've, yeah i've always been super analytical and I never would have imagined the rabbit holes that I would have went down when I started this journey of trying to figure out <laughs> what's yeah. going on down here. Yeah, yeah, it quickly it quickly went into the woo woo because it just made like science got me there, but then as soon as I got there, then all the woo woo popped up. Yeah, on my YouTube feed and everything just everything just meshed and it was just. I was like, oh no, this is the same thing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you start yeah. to start to pick out the little bits that actually all totally. match up. During you see the patterns and you can yeah. see how it all sort of strings together slightly. And you literally feel that sense of knowing that oh my god, like we are all connected. The universe is speaking to me. That's a game changer. Like yeah. that's yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's it. There's also the the other side of it where it's like you have to be a bit careful not to go too far into it. <laughs> Send yourself over the edge if you see what I mean. Yeah. So, yeah. There's a there's a balance point. So uh, yeah. yeah. I think I went over the edge though. Oh, well, I think you have to go. Yeah. You've got to know where the edges are, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Edge. You don't know where the edges are, I suppose. To... I think I went through a rabbit hole so deep that I popped out, and I'm never going back. Like, yeah. <laughs> like it's impossible for me to go back. Like, yeah. You know, no matter what kind of 3D experience I'm having, there's mm -hmm. always that default that we are these magnificent beings of consciousness that shows to lower our frequency and to experience this disconnection from who we really are. And yeah. it makes life a lot easier when when you have that <laughs> when you have yeah. that view once once you've got that view yeah exactly yeah yeah it sounds like you're right there man yeah well i um, yeah I'm, 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 i certainly feel like i'm getting there yeah so i was just um yeah. yeah just try and continue well actually i don't know if we're ever there no i don't think it's an ever evolving yeah. experience is it it's not it it's, i don't think that you know there's not that people say oh i'm done now Do you know what I mean? it's like it doesn't work like that does it yeah, yeah no, no you might be resting for a while yeah but there will be more you will there's be definitely there will be more breadcrumbs to yeah. to keep you excited and to keep you going yeah yeah awesome dude this this should be fun hmm. yeah Are you you married kids girlfriend no i i um recently sort of separated from my girlfriend well she separated from me should we say of sort of health reasons stuff we still see each other but uh okay um it's it's, it's difficult we're still we're still still very much in love but she has issues that that she okay. feels she needs to deal with on her own for the time yeah yeah no well that's that's so, probably valid yeah i think yeah. the best well, another reason for this you know i mean obviously that's quite difficult for me to deal with so so, yeah, absolutely yeah. absolutely but you know what dude if it's meant to be it'll happen and yeah. if it wasn't meant to be we just have to take you know those beautiful lessons and experiences that we that we had and just you know move on yeah exactly you got any questions about anything i do or um not not specifically i don't think so no no i mean i, I mean I nobody ever has any questions no like ever <laughs> yeah. yeah that that's cool yeah i i decisions already been made i haven't really got any quite i know i sort of see what you can do i've seen a lot of like i said i've watched a lot of stuff i do like i do like doing research i mean i, I tend to like really look at something before i you know do anything do you know what I yeah mean? I absolutely like to research stuff so uh so yeah so well i'm yeah 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 cool what are your what are your hobbies um well no i, I go foraging actually I, I, that's what i've started doing quite a lot I've been going out and walk, walks in the woods um I'm quite close to the beach here obviously you know going out going to the beach and things like that but uh music i like i like going out and i do like a party <laughs> yeah, and, uh, yeah, yeah yeah going out enjoying myself i mean at the end of the day it's i i feel like we're you know, we're here to learn, but we're also here to have fun as well. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So. The learning is a given. Yeah. 
like you're going to learn like if you're yeah. on earth you're gonna, so yeah. we should focus on the joy part yeah. of it i mean you know when i first started my journey i wanted to learn everything and then the more i learned the more i realized that i i don't really know so when you were to, like yeah. so when you were talking about you know you got to be careful you know when you start going down these youtube rabbit holes or whatever rabbit holes even the stuff that i really resonate with i mean the stuff that i'm like dude this is the truth there's always this part of me it's like maybe anything else you want to talk about before we do this uh no no i'm all good yeah no. okay okay no. Okay, session's complete. No. Did you um, have any sensations? Um, yeah, yeah, I did. Yeah, it was um, yeah, it's different. A lot of variations. Um, there was, to start with, it sort of like just felt like a bit of a sort of a wave of sort of, of energy that I could feel. And then um, it started to go into a bit of a swirl and then it, it seemed to swirl and it was, it felt like I could almost, I could almost sort of envision, you know, sort of like a, a swirling energy coming, coming up from, from, from my head, but from when I was laying down. Mm -hmm. um, and then it, then at another point it was like a bit like, it felt like, Felt like almost like, you know, like a roof shape, I would say, like a triangle shape, like being 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 sort of flowing down like that way, down and out. Mm -hmm. like that, I don't know. Dif dif difficult to describe, but yeah. And it then it sort of like was switching between those sort of things, sort of waves at different points, and and that. So uh, yeah, yeah, I did. Yeah, started with it. So it felt like there was a bit of a almost like a ball of wool, sort of like shape, all wiggly, all lines, all like that. That then got straightened out at one point um but it was very faint it's sort of like dark on dark if you see what i mean yeah not, yeah, not, yeah not like not like bright colors um uh, yeah sort of like a sort of a cross between a feeling and a and a and a, and a vision do you know what i mean yeah, yeah okay i noticed yeah. you kind of opened your right eye a couple times was yeah. that for any reason or just to check that like did it just happen involuntary or uh, I just, uh, I, 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 I don't know. I, yeah, I'm just so I, I don't know. I suppose I think sometimes my my mind kicks in a bit, and, and I sort of like, oh, what's going on? And oh, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. what's going on? Shut me <laughs> eyes again. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I forgot. Yeah. I pay. I'm paying this guy to to do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah this uh, is really nice relaxed moment. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, you relaxed into it right off the bat yeah i mean i noticed like a couple minutes in i could just see that you you were really relaxing into it did did the feeling start like right off the bat or was there like a delay or well no pr pr pretty much straight away yeah i mean i mean i suppose a few a few seconds into it i started to notice it but then i was sort of like it got to got to the point there where i started to think well i'm actually trying to notice it if you see what i mean so, mm -hmm. so i thought well we need to let go of that a bit and just see see what then, happens yeah the started, brain yeah so yeah you gotta love the mind man it's yeah. constantly trying to like figure the analytical things out. thing going on yeah trying to yeah, work yeah. things out yeah and I, I i i have that very strongly so yeah so okay so here's what i want you to do i want you to hold your hands and like spread your fingers think of it like your palm is almost like the skin of a drum right and so to feel it in the beginning you you want that drum to be tight, okay? You mm. you don't want to kind of like you don't want that. You you kind of want it to like to be yeah. tight, and then I want you to go like palms facing palms, and just slowly just move one hand and see if you can feel some kind of connection in your palms, or it might be a tingling sensation, or it might be heat. Well, I do get, I do, I, I can get a bit of a ting, tingling. I can sort of feel every, you sort of, yeah. Okay. Like, there's like a tingle, like it's a very, very slight. Okay. Slight and, and so slowly, like 
pull your hands apart slowly and see if it changes its the feeling. Uh, it does that. It seems like if you do that, it seems to like get more concentrated towards the center of my hand. Okay. Almost like elastic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Totally like a magnetic almost feeling. Yeah. Yeah. So when you're sitting here and you're doing this and you're just placing your awareness on these sensations, I swear to God, dude, your brain is going into a hyper gamma state. Okay. And that is so much more profound than, than meditating, just playing with these sensations. And, you know, you, you can just be like, well, shit, what if I, what if I did this? Like, can yeah. I feel that in my first finger and my middle finger? Like, does it change or, wow, if I do this, can I feel those pulses in like my, I mean, just literally play. Yeah. And and just, just be aware, I swear. And if you start to, um, do you notice anything when you, when you do that? Um, yeah, I, I can. Uh, it's, it, yeah, it's, it seems to be causing this hand to oh that was weird <laughs> it's cool to see in, uh, uh, that hand to quiver a bit when yeah uh, yeah I, I know that people they're like oh yeah like i'm feeling my chi this is not your chi you can think of it like you can think of it like this is god's chi or like Surfing on a wave of good well, it's just another Friday in paradise So bring your A-game Cause you know this party won't stop We could never run out of time Sipping strawberry lime You know I wanna share it with you